Okay, so this is how you chant the Mystic Law, which is the Buddha Shakyamuni's ultimate and final teaching, which is the Lotus Sutra. And so this is how you do this. You can use beads if you like. Um, they help with the sense of touch and they help you connect with this universal truth that is depicted on this scroll, this piece of paper, which down the middle has Nam Yo Ho Ringe Kyo. And so what you do in order to a practice essential Buddhism in the, the latter day of the law is that you basically acquire yourself a Gohanzan, which is this piece of paper here, which depicts correctly the ten world life condition of the universe and all of Buddhist cosmology depicted on this scroll. So these are all of the functions of the universe depicted in characters which are also called Buddhas because every representation on this chart, on this diagram, is based in Buddhist cosmology which can be backed up with theoretical teachings, actual doctrines of the 48,000 sutras emanated by Shakyamuni Buddha, and through actual proof that you gain from doing this practice. So all that you have to do is sit or kneel or get comfortable, and preferably a straight spine, and you begin with the words Nam Yo Ho Rin Ge Kyo Nam Yo Ho Rin Ge Kyo Nam Yo Ho Rin Ge Kyo and then over the years in the course of your practice you might develop your own style and speed. They say that it's optimal to have the speed of a galloping horse, to chant with high expectations, all of your desires, all of your wishes to be happy, all of your wishes to achieve your dreams, and to retain and acquire the strength, courage, compassion, and wisdom as the four virtues of what a Buddha has. And so everyone has a Buddha nature, which is an awakened nature, an awakened one. You become awakened to the oneness of the individual and the law through this process. Josai Toda, a famous humanitarian of Japan, referred to this piece of paper, think of it as a happiness manufacturing machine. When you chant to this Gohanzan, this Lotus Sutra, you are able to persevere through negative opposition if you continue, and you're able to realize unequaled states of happiness, gain fortune, and all the qualities of a Buddha. Um, regardless if you have an evil disp disposition or a good disposition. If you are chanting this, then in some way, shape, or form, your life will create value for the rest of the world. And these qualities of value are what, what will lead human behavior towards world peace. And so that is why I chant Nam yo ho ding ge go, 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 nam yo ho ding ge go.